Dear ladies and gentlemen, welcome and thank you for coming for my presentation. So uh, I'm coming from 3D Survey Company. It's a company who designed photogrammetry software, which has, in addition, also fun functional parts like volume calculation, profile lines, uh, extraction, uh, CAT integration engine, and so on. And today, I would like to share with you some exciting news about video videogrammetry, what we managed to do with uh, our software, uh, and so on. So on a back screen, you can see me walking around, capturing short video about uh, part of the construction site where they are renewing some uh, water pipes and so on. I'm just creating a short video with my ordinary phone. Uh, at that time, there were no external RTK antenna available, no also second option is uh, available with the RTK antenna. And as you can see it here, with the help of 3D survey software, you can generate really detailed 3D models, uh, mostly because uh, we are close to the object, we have good resolution, uh, and with the help of RTK support antenna, the models are all already uh, geolocated on the right side and scaled in the right scale. Uh, I would like to uh, emphasize again, so we are not triggering images, so uh, we are recording videos. Uh, why we decide for this approach is mainly because if you trigger image by image, you always need to think uh, where you trigger the camera, and need to have good overlap. And in most cases, the results are not so nice. Video, video there is a good advantage that you have at least 30 frames per second. And in the next step of processing, we, have, we can extract exactly frames which we actually need for good 3D model uh, to uh, successfully get uh, out good results. And where we see the power tool for uh, this approach is definitely quick site documentation. Uh, there is a fast data acquisition, so you don't need to set up any device, wait for, I don't know, G GNSS to measure it or something like that. You just turn on your phone, run the 3D survey scan app, connect with the Bluetooth via the device, and we're ready to go. Almost no expertise is needed when you know how to do it. But because of the video, it's much easier in comparison with images. And immediately, you get geotagged video from our application. So during the capturing, we geotag the video. And you don't have some separated files with log uh, files and everything like that. This is all in the frames and works very nice. Uh, use cases, definitely uh, undergrowth piping, like uh, heating pipes, water pipes, sewer pipes, or something like that. So if you need to repair manholes or something like that, and infrastructure excavation projects. And the beauty of everything is this is, again, uh, everything integrated in a single software, 3D survey. Uh, here you will see me in a real case how this is doing during the construction process. Uh, so I'm holding the same device as I'm having here. Uh, now I'm connecting with the entry help uh, and getting the accuracy. In the upper right corner over my screen, you can see the accuracy. In a few seconds, we have one to two centimeter accuracy. And then you just walk around your area of interest. Uh, I agree I was not professionally equipped for this video, but this is the benefit of this equipment. So you have it in your pocket. When you need it, you use it. Uh, so I just saw a really nice excavation on the street, and I decided to map it. So it takes me one minute and a half. It's great to walk around. Uh, if you have some experience with drone mapping, uh, the approach should be really the same. So that kind of projects are perfect for that because you still have some view from the upper side. And this is already blue pyramids or camera positions where we extract frameos and the point cloud from this side. So if you imagine, I did a mapping in half of, let's say, in a two minutes. The processing time is half an hour, fully automatic. 
and you get uh, georeference 3D models. Uh, next step is then texture 3D models, and you can extract any data you, can, uh, you would like to extract in the next step. What's important to have it? So after you finish with data acquisition, in great to have it also tools that you can come to the end results. And this is uh, special about our solution. Uh, so it's not just a photogrammetry software with videogrammetry support. It has also a functional part, OK? So everything what you see is developed based on real feed experience. So I'm a surveyor. As most of you are also surveyors, so we know what's going on on the field, and everything is in a single package. And then after you have uh, that kind of data, you can easily calculate of maybe volume of materials. Uh, I would say it's more reasonable to measure smaller areas. If you have big stockpiles, maybe like this one there, it's still hard. It would be possible to do with that device. but. Uh, if you have option, it's much easier with drone. But smaller areas, smaller stockpiles, not a problem. Uh, then if you have an uh, area like you see before, you can easily calculate all profile lines and cross sections. Uh, after you generate a full 3D mesh, you can generate uh, contour lines uh, in a second. So this is everything then just one click away. And again, uh, if you have more measurements for the same site, you can import them all in a single project and do the time monitoring, so upon the change or what was done uh, on a field and so on. Uh, to get out uh, important points and lines, we also integrated the CAT engine in the software because, you know, traditional way, if you do the measurement, uh, measuring uh, those kind of uh, projects, traditional way with GNSS device, at the end, you need to deliver them uh, two uh, 3D lines uh, with some special points and so on. And you can do this uh, in the software with the help of image support. So on the left side, I'm uh, fine-tuning the position of the cat lines. And because we have this support, you can be uh, also super accurate. Uh, nevertheless, uh, if you are not on the right side, on your construction site, uh, monitoring or something like that, we have some integrated uh, manipulation tools in addition. So if you need to select some area, higher points, lower points, delete them, and so on. Uh, so also interesting feature, which could come with uh, videogrammetry and post-processing thing is X-ray or the photo of the site. Uh, for example, you do a quick scan around the buildings. You get a nice point cloud from building facade, maybe the first two, uh, two meters or something like that. And uh, at the end, with the help of this point cloud and X-ray function, you can easily uh, extract those data also. Uh, there are also options to combine multiple data types. So uh, if you do a mapping with a video videogrammetry, you can easily combine this with a drone mapping. Okay? Some of our users, uh, they are actually constantly uh, combining those kind of methods. So sometimes there are some trees, or maybe uh, the, the buildings is designed like so that you don't come nicely close to the detail with a drone camera. Uh, take the device, measure additionally. You can process the data in the same project uh, easily together. And at the end, create old quick sketch drawings and share with your, uh, with your clients. When we do the videogrammetry scans for a building or something like that, uh, we can easily get a nice model of facade out of it because it's super easy. Usually facades are vertical. Uh, you have a good camera position from this side. And at the end, you can easily create uh, orthophoto for specific plane, like a facade orthophoto. And uh, when you export this as a TIFF, this is a standard orthophoto file where you can do the 2D vectorization. At the end, it's always great to share your results with clients. Uh, for that kind of purpose, you have, you have a fly pet recorders. Most all of the videos were recorded with this uh, function, the ones you see in the software. So you just define the camera positions, and uh, the software records the video pet and create your video. 
the second option is to share your results with a 3D survey cloud. It's a share platform and project management tool directly from desktop software. You just click Cloud Upload. Uh, you get your project uh, view in a cloud, create a new project. Every project can have more sites. So it means uh, if you come five times to the same location, uh, you have time measurements in the five different days, and you just upload them in the same project, and then you can do some time comparison and share with your clients. Last but not least, we have a beautiful booth down there. Okay, uh, Come and visit us in Hall 25, booth 25.63. Uh, we are happy to present you all this technology in a real case uh, on a one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, we have a lot of exciting uh, projects to show you. And if you don't have time, nevertheless, visit our webpage, 3dsurvey.si. Uh, sign in for use. You will get all the uh, interesting information via email.